Welcome to Saline TV's Unboxing FileMaker 14. I'm John Ross Lamprecht, and in this video I'll be talking about the new Set Allowed Orientations functionality. Set Allowed Orientations enables you to specify a specific orientation for a layout, whether it's only landscape, only portrait, or both. At the top right, you can see there are two buttons here, an iPad and landscape, an iPad and portrait mode. Right now we're actually looking at an AirPlay of my iPad on my MacBook. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit the landscape iPad button on my iPad. And what this does is it sets the allowed orientations to only landscape. So I'm going to turn my iPad right now and you can see that nothing is occurring. You will see though if I go to the reverse landscape that it flips over. Now what I'm going to do is select the portrait iPad and what this does is it resets it so that all orientations are allowed. So when I hit that, now when I turn it to portrait mode, we can see that it turns. So it's really important that I only let my users go to landscape mode because as you can see, portrait mode does not turn out too great. So now let's get out of the iPad and go to FileMaker Pro. So now I'm on FileMaker Pro on my MacBook. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to enter layout mode, and I'm just going to click on my button to open up the button setup and take a look at the single step I did for this. So here's our script step, set allowed orientation. As you can see, there's a number of different settings you can use. You can set portrait, you can set portrait upside down or reverse portrait, you can set landscape left and landscape right. When I did the landscape mode, I set both landscape left and landscape right on and left the portraits off. This means that the iPad layout will only be in landscape mode and will not let the user go into portrait mode. Using the set allowed orientations, you can keep your user from going into orientations that would destroy your UI and design. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to Saline TV to view more videos from the Unboxing FileMaker 14 series.